and I'm bringing people together for our tomorrow to have conversations across political divides. We're going to be bringing undergrads with different political perspectives to talk about topics like immigration, student debt, and the American dream. And we'll be holding our first conversation in a couple weeks. I connect with others by reaching out to my friends, my family, uh, going back to my hometown, speaking at my high school, to these kids who probably didn't know much about sustainability and environmental science until I went and gave them a presentation on all the things they could do. I stand up with community by bringing people together to serve the marginalized community, such as the homeless and the poor, um, by providing them with basic necessities, such as food and household supplies. And I stand with community by tutoring K through third graders to help them discover their love for reading and develop their early literacy skills. I come from a big city and I came from a big school, uh, so I was kind of concerned about coming to an even bigger school here and not having a community to be part of. And finding my dad's community has been something super important to me. There's so much power in community and it really helps to not feel alone in something. So to fight for a cause, it's great to have friends and people to be in it with you. So mental health is something that's deeply personal and the stigma against it can cause a lot of people to feel isolated. So when you know that there is a community for you who is there, who understands you, and you can feel like nobody really walks this earth alone, I think that's really important. And that's what Letters to Strangers is trying to do. And I'm bringing students together through Stanford Mental Health Outreach by destigmatizing mental illness at Stanford and helping students learn how to better care for themselves and others. So we're not only just being sort of passive members or part of our individual groups or community, but we're coming together to build something great. I use music as my medium to connect with others. Trying to find ways to make music um, and service more interconnected on our campus, which um, is why I'm here at the Moorbridge Center for Public Service. We are really trying to have students engage with the community that's right outside of the gates, which doesn't usually happen, surprisingly, but we think that service is a great way, a great medium for learning more about the community that's right there next to us that we're a part of. Community goes beyond the people who share our town lines and our classroom walls. We share a community with the people on the other side of the planet and our actions here impact them there. I stand with community by being sustainable, sharing the initiatives, and making a cleaner today for what's to come tomorrow. in this one big machine and without one part that machine couldn't run.